we've got the UDR, the LCG Ultimate, and the High CG Ultimate. So we're going to do some speed bump speed testing, see how the, the three chassis react. guys we have made it to the track we are the only ones here here with my uncle and my dad we've got the two slashes and uh yeah we're gonna be running let me run up here this is christmas eve by the way too so probably not gonna be too busy but yeah check this out first time here my dad's lived here for a couple years and didn't even know it existed and uh yeah we're gonna give it a, a first drive record some clips for you yeah you're gonna need more momentum <laughs> Fold it under. All right, we are up on the driver's stand. We did a couple laps off camera. This is way harder than it looks. <laughs> These rhythm sections, I cannot seem to figure out. I am driving the, the new Ultimate, the green and blue. My dad is driving his original. Yeah, these, these doubles are... This, I can make it up this back one, though. Oh! Or not. <laughs> oh, no. Are you stuck? No, I'm good. I think my ride height is just way too low. Bottom down everything. Oh. Hey.
Thanks, Mark. Yeah, so this track surface is clay. Uh, we both have the S1 tires, which would be the best tire for, best stock Traxxas tire. So I don't think we're at too much of a disadvantage, but it is not easy. I'm struggling more with the jump timing than, <laughs> than anything. And yeah, we've got Mark down there marshalling for us, so thank you, Mark. We got the GoPro on the whip. Got to do some laps. Turn this on. Hopefully it stays. I put it on the hood instead of the uh, the roof because we've been flipping so much. I have a feeling if I put it on the roof, I'm just gonna get wrecked. But I think the perspective looks pretty good. So Mark has been driving for a bit. Um, I think my dad's gonna take control again and we are gonna try a race. I raised my ride height a little bit. Do you wanna drive the car so you take it out of the train? No, I'm gonna drive it. Where do you wanna line up at? I need to get out of the train mode. Get out of the train. Oh, you don't want your own train mode? No, I keep Right, Mark. Yeah. Mark, my car has um, a gyro in it, and it mimics the the caster on your car. So you know how in your real car, if you get into a slide, it will kind of self steer. So it's doing that in real time. Oh, that's really so you almost need to kind of steer less because if you start to slide it, it's automatically counter steering. It will help bring it back down. It. So that's, that's another more recent advancement with yeah, RC cars. Yeah, dad does not. It doesn't make like a huge difference and some people hate it, but I, I like it. Say what? Like anything you can use to it. Oh, the fence is 
house of doom. <laughs> And turning in the air really makes it pitch. Thank you, Mark. You got it. Wheelie. All right, here we go. We're starting here. Sure. Thank you. Are you guys going to race? Yeah. Uh, maybe not. Let's start on this actual grid. and do our first race. All right. You want to count it off, Mark? Sure. Ready? Yep. Set, go. Thing is me. <laughs> Put that four wheel drive to work. Get caged animal, thank you. Ah, I'm good. down. Mark, get set, go! <laughs> Dog pile. Ow. Well, neck and neck. Thank you. How many laps? Three? 
Yeah, we're gonna go for three. Oh. oh you're building a solid lead. Thank you. Is that just your second laugh, right? gotten a good rhythm section one time. That was a crazy endo. Did you get that? All right, so we did three races. I think I won two, my dad won one. Now we switched cars. We're gonna see how the two of them feel. So keep in mind, he in the older Ultimate has the high CG chassis. New one's got the LCG. He has 10 year old S1 tires, which are, are very sticky, so they're not dry rotted or anything. But then the Newer Ultimate, of course, has new tires. There's a different steering servo. It's a lot faster. Yeah, yours is kind of... Yours is understeering a lot. And then, yeah, this thing high centers on the jumps pretty easily. I love that little leap yeah. up the mountain. That's a lot of fun. Keeping busy, Mark. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, Sounds like shit. the body's messed up, huh? There you go. Thank you. Nice. Yeah, 
Yeah, I, I have such a hard time with that one. I need to get on the throttle more to stop some nose diving. Yeah, does yours nose dive as much? Because no. this one just nose dives like crazy. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that flew nice. Yeah, I, I don't like your steering feel as much. I need to check your servo endpoints or something. It's like it doesn't even want to turn. Sorry, Mark. I did not think you would actually have to marshal this much. Get my steps in. Yeah. Oh. I gotta lose this fat ass body I got. Yeah. <laughs> We're still not that great at it either. <laughs> it's not easy. Well, you guys don't play that often. Yeah, dude, I do this like every single time. Like not making that. Try and keep you off of there, Mark. Sorry about that. Hey, you guys. Oh, wait, wait, sorry. Put your arm Oh, you're good. Thank you. Yeah, you're just definitely pushing. Yeah, you you can rent one. Can yeah. Yeah, we want to go ask. Yeah. Okay. I'll come yeah. I'll come with you. Let's I'll come with you. Well, I'll go with. Maybe we throw these on the charger while we. Okay. <laughs> Ow. And <tough>. finish. <laughs> Got our first casualty, the new Ultimate. Looks like it just the hinge pin backed out. So I'll have to pop that back in and keep running. Well, actually, this is not the first casualty. The old truck, I think I, I did something when I tried to turn it off. I held the button too long and now it's in like a programming mode that I can't get it out of. So we're gonna have to do some wrenching to figure this out. All right, so man, I I, I could see myself kind of getting into this. <laughs> yeah, it's fun, right? Man, yeah, I kind of want to get one, but you know, but it's not fun if you just have one by yourself. It's like, yeah, you you kind of need kinda need a group to run with them. Yeah, you might as well. Do they? Yeah, I wonder if they they do like. Um, like a subscription thing where you could just come unlimited for yeah, that's mm -hmm. because otherwise what it what is track time I think it was 20 bucks, 20 bucks for the day 
for the day. So it's not really too bad, all things considered. Right. This was obviously a very short day, but I think most days. Just take it for longer. longer. I want to hand it back to him dirty. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> you wash a red I could de- before you return it? I could detail this for you if you got it. Rough it out. <laughs> Put a. Yeah, let's give some some closing closing statements here. So, yeah, we're we're done for the day. Oh, thank you. Mark ended up renting a, a two wheel drive slash. This thing is super clapped out, puffed battery. Um, it's got like a five mile an hour Ball top tires. speed. Tires are bald, <laughs> um, but it was no, it, it was pretty fun. Well. Yeah, the the ESC cuts out, but we we had some good runs. Um, <laughs> accidentally put my dad's truck into a programming mode because the button got stuck down. We were able to fix that. And then we had the hinge pin back out of the new Ultimate, but we popped that back in. It didn't bend or anything. So The new Ultimate yeah. wins, that's for sure. Yeah, the that new was the, best the new Ultimate yeah, was the most amazing. fun to drive. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what we expected, right? <laughs> yeah, hopefully it's... Mm-hmm. Yes, it hopefully you pay for it. So yeah, I don't. I don't this know. This thing for ten years old still. That thing is is fun. I think man. if I put new tires on it, it would be pretty close to the. Yeah, there's. I mean, there's really nothing wrong with it. I would say. I think we just. Oh, let's see if we can get some shock oil before we leave. Okay. We'll refill those and. Um, all right, so it is Christmas Day. We are down here at the beach with the family. Uh, we are here with my dad driving the UDR. We just fitted fitted the Traxxas paddle tires. We've not even tried the stock tires, but he wanted to go straight to the paddles. So we're gonna give it some rips. Ready? And uh, yeah, have some fun. Yeah, let me get up here. All right, let her eat. <laughs> Felt like the sand vibrate when that thing took off. Oh, yeah, three wheeling. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> oh my god! Ah, I got it. Flipped it. Oh yeah, and I, I brought my defender too. <laughs> We're gonna try to, we brought a shovel. We're gonna try to make a little crawler course in the sand, maybe to see if we can find something. Let's see. Look at that, a little, little full of sand, not too bad. Yeah, when you're running, you just gotta make sure you're looking ahead of the car. Because what you don't wanna do is turn and then you're driving directly at something full speed, you know? Yeah, thing is going. Paddle tires are almost a must for this kind of stuff. It would probably still work, but it would not be like, just hooking yeah. up like it is. Yeah, it actually has a lot of traction. Yeah. Yeah, they put it up on three wheels. So they rub the body a little bit. Yeah. Oh, oh. 
Ha, <laughs> really in. I don't think I am. Was it too close? No, you're all right. I don't think it was too close. You got to be close. Yep. It's just like working, yeah, the body's like barely moving. behind the wheel we've already been driving it a bit mark's helping us build a ramp no it's a pretty good sign oh you missed <laughs> yeah just a quick little Low voltage. Did pretty well. 
well, though. Yeah, the, the, the four... Got like sand ladders. They see this is one where your lightweight one would probably do a lot better. Oh, okay, so I'm just sinking yeah, more. right because it's just yeah. Try a different angle or maybe a little. Uh, you, you're trying to get up here? I want to tackle this, this hump here, right here. Oh, okay, okay. Oh. There, there he goes. It nice. You got it.
I left a pretty big hole there earlier. Oh, that's the shot. That's the thumbnail right there. Take it down. Oh. tire tracks around here. <laughs> It's really nothing that you need to upgrade, but if you want new wheels, you have to get new tires because oh, okay, yeah. the, they're not compatible. You can't change them yeah. yeah. So I, I wanted new wheels. It was the only reason why I upgraded. Got it. Yeah, this thing's a tank. That's why I love it so it's just, much. It's just so slow. It's like, yeah, it's just a monster. <laughs> And I love it, like, it, it's not even, like, jacked up super high or oh. anything either. It's, like, really pretty low. Yeah, I think the the bike the bike track outdoors is looking better and better. <laughs> Oh Everyone is just running. <laughs> <laughs> Mayhem. <laughs> yeah, these guys are all drunk or something. Some good looking slashes out here, both of the fox slashes. The, I love that pink body too. The pink body is sweet. So is that yeah. a slash? Yep, that's a slash. These are all I, I've got that white fox body at home. That's cool. I like that. Yeah, I, I love that one. Yeah, super clean. I have this orange one at home too. I like the green one though that you have. I think that's yeah. Cool. <laughs> Slunch, man. <laughs> No. Yeah, they <laughs> Yeah, they, they, these are experienced drivers. <laughs> exactly. Oh, no, no. It was like going sideways and but it landed just soaked that all that yeah. and, like catching a little. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love watching it recover. Alright, we are at a BMX park. We Swung by the hobby shop, but there were a ton of people on the track and they did not look like the most experienced drivers. So we uh, decided to swing by here. Uh, this is, again, it's like 10 minutes from our house. It's actually on the way to the hobby shop. First time here. So we're gonna check it out and uh, see what's up. Up on a little observation deck here. See if we can uh, get a better visual.
Oh. Did not bring enough sticky mounts. Let me see, let me get a video of you, uh... Oh, yeah. Oh! That might have broke something. Yeah, that broke it. Uh-oh. Damn! How did that break it? Oh, it broke the arm. Oh my God. It, it bent your shock too. Did it? Holy shit. You can see it's bent, the shaft yeah, is bent? Yeah, the shaft's bent. Oh man. They had UDR arms at the hobby shop. So I gotta get a whole new shock for that? Yeah. I don't know if I've got a shock though. Damn. Oh, I, that thing just popped like it was nothing. Wow. You were you were going like five miles an hour too. What did you hit? It happened right here. Bam. Right on that. I can't believe how easily that broke. Yeah, the shock's definitely bent. I think only the front one, hopefully. Did it totally break? Yeah, it's off. Oh, crap. That's insane. It just, it hit it like a brick wall. Yeah. You can see where the, the yeah. arm hit the concrete right. instead of the tire. The tire would have hit it. Yeah. You wanna go back to the shop and see if they have something to replace? They've got that arm. I remember I saw it, but I don't know if they would have one of those shocks. Shock, you might be able to get away with bending it back, but the shock um, busted up too. The shock yeah. shaft is bent. Well, that was pretty short lived. Man, that sucks. Oh, they break right. Go ahead. Or maybe I'll hold that. a really bad place for a pole, man. Yeah. <laughs> like coming off the knees like... <laughs>
They're not even challenging. I wonder if... I got that on film or not. Rest in peace. No. Go ride the berm over here. Oh, this looks like it might have been like a seesaw yeah. thing. Seems like this place is kind of in a state of disrepair. Yeah. It's no concrete. <laughs> Let me go see. Saw some more obstacles further back. So here we go. Go take a look. A pair of shorts just in case. Oh, you're in the brush. Yeah, here we go. I don't know if they were planning on expanding this and just never did or what. Not not much of an obstacle here. What do you think? Is it gonna teeter totter? Yep. It's starting to rain a little bit too. Looks like some people are out riding recently. Like an actual trail trail through here maybe. I'm sure it's not that exciting.
difficult, huh? I don't know if I would call this difficult. Let's see what the boys are up to. What do you think? Any broken slashes? Probably not. No, it looks like they're battling it out. There, there's a couple more obstacles, but nothing too entertaining. Look at that, the trooper. What's that? There's, there's a couple obstacles, but it doesn't look like it would be anything too entertaining. There's potential for a decent little circuit, but they don't have any big jumps like these. How's the, the new Ultimate doing? Man, I, I can't believe how fragile the UDR is. Well, I, think about how heavy it is. Yeah, that's, that that's what I was thinking. That it's, yeah, it's a lot of momentum yeah. behind it, even at slow speed. It's not like the uh, UDR. Here, you can kick the cameraman. All right. The slashes are doing better than I would have thought over this terrain. Through Even the kind in of the grass, grass, too. And everything. Yeah. It's really not bad. It hasn't really got bogged down at no. all. It's my first time really driving them in, in grass. It's, it's fun if you can get a nice little rhythm through Whoa. here. <laughs> I don't know if you ever had them really hard on the brakes before, but it's amazing how well these things stop too. You can go full speed and just punch the brakes and it'll, it'll grind to a halt. Oh, oh. endo. That was braking with the nose down. signs in some dangerous places. Yeah. Very bad foot locations. Unless you like the challenge of being impaled. Yeah. It's awesome, like, what is this? I don't know. Here, let's see. Yeah. Oh, it's rollers and tabletops. Oh, yeah. I get it now. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't see that. Did you hit your foot? You okay? Is that self-inflicted? Yep. 
Oh, oh. Oh, oh nice. Did you re injure your toenail? I think I did. No way. You're just not having good luck out here today. Dad's like 0 for 3 on family events without breaking a toenail. Oh, whoa! whoa. Kickflip! <laughs> that was awesome! <laughs> You wanna <laughs> Holy cow, look at that. Oh. Damn. Is that the same toenail? Yep. Oh. Yeah, that's that's messed up. <laughs> we need to get you some real shoes. Yeah. Some wires. Steel toe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna need to. <laughs> Mandatory <laughs> steel toe boots during the next healing period. Good. <laughs> I think I'm gonna try it on. <laughs> Go for it, man. <laughs> no. Did your dad want to cut a little piece off, or? I, I think he already put his foot back in the shoe, so the damage has been done. It is large. Now, now, what situation does a man find himself in where you're? You're taking off your nice dress shirt at a BMX park and then forgetting it. <laughs> like, <laughs> and it, wearing it to a BMX yeah, park. Like, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't see any underwear around. So yeah. <laughs> well, there's there are some um, uh, swim trunks under that tree over there. So maybe it's... Swim maybe, trunks. Maybe, 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 try, maybe try to reconstruct the crime scene. I don't know. Maybe he was running around in swim trunks and a, a dress shirt and... One by one, they came off. Certainly on hallucinogenics. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you have swim trunks over here. It's like surprisingly hard to navigate this berm because it, it tries to kind of slide. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's fun slide though. Slide like down. Ooh, I thought that was going to be a head on. Place. Yeah. That was a perfect line. Yeah, that was perfect. Or if we can position this at the top of the berm. Oh wow, dude, this is a lot steeper than than it looks. The GoPro. The GoPro came off. Oh, it got broken. It's live action, baby. GoPro mounts busted. What even hit it? This. Oh yeah. There's the other half. Man, it kind of stinks. I like this mount a lot. Why would you put that there? Man, we're breaking everything here. Jeez. This is like real RC where everything breaks. You don't leave until everything's broken. Yeah, well that's that's Kevin Talbot Kevin, RC. Yeah. I, I prefer to leave with a working truck. Well this is fine. Is that fine? Your your front of your body's stuck in your light bar. Let's see that's not that's the worst yeah. thing that happened, you're good. You're yeah. GoPro kind of hit on the side of it. Yeah. The, the GoPro mount got busted. Yeah. 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 The cage broke open. Oh man, did I hit it? Somebody uh, must yeah. have. That's fine. Hazards of the job, man. Yeah. This thing's ancient too. I think I've had it since like high school. Oh, just chuck it then. Yeah, right.
very much grip on this gravel. All right, I don't know if we'll get to drive more um, before leaving, but we'll see. So far though, I mean, yeah, for, for going from brand new, she's pretty, pretty banged up, um, but nothing's broken yet. It's all, it's all driving really well, still drives great. Um, no issues with the other slash either though. This shock will probably be, they probably get sold in pairs. It's probably like 35 for a pair. The arm's probably 10 or something. Oh really, that's it? Yeah, yeah none of it's ever that expensive. Oh yeah, I forgot about telemetry on this thing. We haven't even really been using it. It's weird not having fans on this either. I'm used to having fans on all my trucks. I'm just silent, can't even tell it's on. All right, folks, um, not sure if we'll get to drive more. Um, probably maybe some crawling or something. We'll see if, if we get any more footage for you. But if not, it's been a great time with the slashes. Sucks about the UDR though, but that's how she goes.